babes and welcome to my first YouTube video. My name is Jakia and on this channel we will be talking about lifestyle, home decor, and travel. If any of that is of interest to you, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and go ahead and share my channel. We're trying to grow this channel and become a family. So a little bit about myself. I am 39. I just had a birthday on Christmas Day. Yay. Yes, I'm a Christmas baby. Also, I am a mother of a 19-year-old daughter, Jaslyn. I am a flight attendant for a major U.S. airline. And me and my boyfriend, we just purchased our first home. And, well, it's been about two years now. But it's still our brand new home. And we're trying to get this, uh, I'm trying to get it, finish getting it decorated. So, guys, you will be coming along with me um, to finish getting this house together. Um, yeah, it's a lot. Also, once I go back to work, you all will be going with me on my trips. So we're going to jump right on into this video. Today is Wednesday, January 10th. And I just, um, got ready for the day. Um, I have on this two piece set from Walmart. Let's see. So I got on this two piece set from Walmart. It's just the leggings and they're high waisted. And then the long sleeve shirt and it's ribbed material. And then I got on my puffer vest, my Benelac sequence Uggs, um, my glasses, not designer, just some cute little fashion glasses I like to wear, and uh, my Kirk Geiger crossbody. So, I mean, we don't have much to do today. We are going to head to go get these eyebrows waxed, and then whatever else we get into today i won't be out long because me and my boyfriend just welcomed our first child together it's a boy and his name is kane and he's our new little six week old bully puppy so we are still training him and I don't want to be out long because I don't want him to be in his crate for too long. But when I get back, I will introduce you guys because my baby is asleep right now and we're not going to disturb him. So I'm going to go ahead, finish doing what I need to do in the house. And I'm going to head to the car. And I'll see you there. Bye. Okay, babes. Hey, we made it to where I go get my eyebrows done at. Um, I didn't know it was as warm as it was outside, so I ended up taking off my puffer. It's saying 67 degrees. I, that's what happens when you don't look, check the, um, weather before you get dressed. But yeah, I'm here. Um, they have an eyebrow threading place inside, and this is where I go and get my eyebrows threaded. So, we're gonna go in here. And then I made some spaghetti um, the night before last, and um, I made a salad, but we ate the salad up. So I need to get some lettuce and cucumbers. I still have tomatoes. I need to get another red onion and a green onion. Yeah. So those are the things I need to get. And then we are across the street from a Hobby Lobby. And I bought this bowl, this ceramic bowl from Target last week. And it's sitting on top of my TV stand in the living room. And it kind of looks bare because nothing is in it. And I think I need some greenery in that whole little area. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over here to Hobby Lobby and look for some moss. Once we leave out of HEB, we'll be heading over to... Um, Hobby Lobby. I'm 
I know I said I probably wasn't going to bring y'all in here, but she did such a good job on my eyebrows. So, we're going to go ahead and pick up a few little items inside of HEV, and we'll be on our way over to Hobby Lobby. See you there. guys we are headed into Hobby Lobby for this moss so let me this is so cute I would love to have this for my patio but we already got stuff on there it's $279.99 those are so cute I like this little shelf. I like these little shelves. Let's see. All right, y'all. We are back in the car from Hobby Lobby. I did not get the I had it in my hand, but after I started kind of walking around Hobby Lobby, um, I ended up putting it back and I picked up three other items for the house. Um, just some cute little decor to put um, in places in my house. Um, all of it is black because I needed to add some more little black pieces in. So I'll show you once we head, uh, make it to the house. I'm headed home now. So I gotta go get back home to see my baby. I know he's probably like, where's my mommy? So um, yeah, that's what we're doing, headed home. And I'll pick back up with you guys um, once I make it to the house. Okay, y'all, I am back at home. Um, had to get the puppy together. He's back sleep again. So, um, I'm going to introduce him, but once I get him back up again. But I do want to show y'all what I picked up from Hobby Lobby. Um, it was just three little decor pieces to go around my house. This is my TV stand here in the living room. And back up. Okay. And so, um, I bought this, uh, little bead-like situation. I'm still playing with it, but for now, I'm just going to do it like that. Because I felt like, aside from the TV being black and the handles and stuff on the TV stand... I needed something black up there because I got a lot of gold going on and like white or cream. So that threw in the black there. Um, so we still, like I say, I'm piecing together stuff. When I see stuff that I like, I um, buy it and then bring it home and see how it looks. So I like that like that. At first, I was going to get some green moss to fill inside the bowl. I don't know. I still kind of feel like I want to do that. But right now, we're just going to do this because I didn't pick up the moss. Okay. And then in the kitchen, excuse my kitchen, y'all. It's not dirty. It's just we got stuff. Um, I got this little sign that says eat. This is just like a little lazy Susan thing that spins. And I had put that little faux plant back there salt and pepper shakers and then my olive oil um bottle and then this is a lime turning into a lemon and then i felt like i needed something black here so um i did that i don't know if i want to keep it out like that or put it in but if you put it in you can't really see it so i think i'm gonna leave it like this and it says eat Okay, 
So that's what we have right there. And then in my entryway, hopefully you guys can see, but this is my entryway table. I have this black mirror that I bought from Sam's. It was $50. And then I got this lamp from Ross. No, Home Goods. I can't remember exactly how much this little lamp was, but it was cute. It was cream. It had the cream shade. And then it had the glass. And then it had some trimming of gold in the black base. And then we had got these little gold elephants. And then this was from Christmas. Don't pay that. We had Chris. We spent Christmas at my house. So then I bought this little um, thing from Hobby Lobby. And because I'm trying to fill this space up. Um, so, so far, this is what I have. I'm looking for maybe a book, some books to go right there. And so right now. The little home sign is what it is, and I just put it in the center. But I like it. I do like the little thing. It says home, and then it has, like, little brown beading through it and the little brown tassel on each end. And then I bought this last week. I finally got a vase or, yeah, and these faux branches from Target. This is Hearth and Hand. Hand and Hearth, Hearth and Hand, I think, by Joanna Gaines. It was 25 and then these branches, I bought two branches, and they were $5 a piece. So I got that. And then we got this little TV, I mean, entryway table from Wayfair, I think. And then down at the bottom, I bought this basket from home. Did I get it from Home Goods? Yes, I got it from Home Goods. And I bought this cream throw. And I just have it draped over the basket. Um, trying to figure out if I'm going to put something right here. Not 100% sure. It does look a little bare right there. And then I bought these lanterns from Walmart and the little candles that's inside them. I bought them from Walmart. Um, they're battery operated candles, so it's a little switch at the bottom and you can just turn them on. Um, so yeah. Okay, babes, it's later on in the day and, um, I'm about to mop my floors. I, uh, made a concoction in my old cedar mop bucket right here. And basically it has... What does it have in here? It has uh, vinegar, bleach, downy beads. I'm trying the downy beads because with a dog, you know, a dog can smell up the house. So downy beads, and then I'm about to put some hot water in here. I'm moving my bar stools out the way. So we can get started. But bear with me, you guys. I uh, bought a tripod. It should be here later on today. From Amazon. And then I can kind of set you up better than what I've been what I'm doing. But just bear with me. Y'all know I'm new to this, but I'm gonna be true to this. So y'all just hold on. Bear with me. So I use my tea kettle because it hots, it get heat, it gets hot fast to heat up the water and then I'm going to pour it in but I got to be careful because I don't want the mouth of it to touch this book. Got it smelling really good already, just the water. So maybe this little concoction I uh, made 
it's going to work out and have my floors and my house smelling really good. And then, like I said, I have bleach and white vinegar, distilled vinegar in here as well. So, I'll go ahead and get started with my... Okay, I'm back. The puppy is up. So, I'm going to take you guys in here to see him. He's playing in his room. Well, it's actually my boyfriend's man cave. And we put him in here in the man cave. Because he the man. Okay. Kane. Kane. Okay, let me sit y'all here on top of his cage. And I'm gonna get him. Come here. Come here, Pooh. I would like to introduce my baby Kane. Say hello to the people. Say hi. Say hi to the girlies. Say hi to the girlies. Say hi. My name is Kane and I'm very active. But then I'm a baby. And all I do is eat, poop, play, and sleep in that order. So I'm playing right now. I'll be going back to sleep in just a moment because that's what I do. You see the girls? Say hi to the girls. He wants to get down. And if I put him down, he probably going to attack my shoe. He tends to love to take over my house shoe. So, say hello. Say hi. <laughs> He's six weeks old. Look at him. But he busy. He is busy. Say, I'm busy. Say, I'm busy. Okay, okay. He didn't pull his blanket down. Look, I'm going to turn the camera around. Kane, 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 Kane. What are you doing? Where is... This is what I mean, y'all. Look, look. Stop. He is <laughs> he is fascinated with tearing, taking my shoe. Kane, stop, 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 stop. Ah, no. Literally, I have to put my feet up. No, 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 no. Go get your stuff out of your cage. Here, let's get yours. Come on, look. Oh, so I gave him my old shoe. He has toys, but he just tends to want to play with my stuff. He got his little dental treat. He said he want his breath to smell good. So this is the new baby of the house. And but he's a sweetie. That's our new little busybody. So anyways, y'all. So I've introduced y'all to Kane. And um yeah. So it's nothing else gonna go on today. Um so I will talk to you guys. 
tomorrow. Bye. Hey, babes. It's the next day. It is Thursday, January the 11th. And I'm up getting ready to go. I have to run a couple of errands today. But other than that, it was a slow morning. Just got up, got the dog together, fed him, let him run around and play, took him outside. And that was it on that. And then I showered and um, gotten dressed. Um, I need to go and uh, to a feed store to get him some dog food that they only carry at, at the feed store. And then um, I do need to go like to a regular store like Walmart or H-E-B to get um, this other dog food for some wet food for him. And then um, I was thinking about going to get my nails done today. Um, but I think I might wait till tomorrow to do that. I'ma see. I'ma just see. Today is a actual it's actually a pretty day outside. I mean the sun is out, it's warm. How many de what is it saying? The degrees is it's saying it's 75 degrees. The wind is blowing. I mean it's beautiful outside. So I'm thinking I may go get my nails done, but I don't know because I hurt this nail and it's really sore, and I kind of don't want them messing with it right now. But I don't think they Nothing is going to change between today and tomorrow, I don't think, on the pain. It may, but I don't think so. So, we're going to see. Um, but I'm already dressed, so I'm going to let you know what I have on. So, I just have on this... Let me back up some. I have on this t-shirt dress that I got from H&M. It's a really cute, comfy dress. Um, I've been had this dress for a while, so I'm not too for sure how much I paid for the dress. How much I paid on the dress. But it's a cute little dress. It has pockets on both sides. And then it has a slit on each side. So it's just a comfortable little dress. And I paired that with my Jordan Concords. Black and white Concords. So I got those on. And then um, my glasses that I like to wear. My little fashion glasses. Um, my necklace that my mom bought me from Zell's. It has my birthstone in it, my James Avery jewelry, my Apple Watch. Don't pay attention to this. I burnt myself last Saturday color, color, curling my hair. And then I just, I got my hair pulled back in a little ponytail. And I just added a little, some curls on the end. Um, got my diamond earrings in. Um, from Zell's and yeah that's it oh and then I have on my everyday crossbody purse from Kirk Geiger so I have that and then um I put a little eye um I did my eyebrows I'm not your you're gonna learn this about me I am not the makeup girly I don't really wear it I wear it every blue moon, but on a day-to-day -day basis, you're not going to see my face fully beat. What you see is what you get. So, this is what you're getting. Like I may put a little eyeliner, um, eyeshadow on in the creases. I might uh, do a little blush, a little highlighter here and there, but that's it. The lip combination is just a brown pencil, and then it's a nude lip. And it's a brown uh, brown pencil and then this NYX Butter Gloss is what I'm using. And then for fragrance, I, I have on Gucci, Gucci Flora. I love this scent. I think I'm a floral girl. I, I, I'm starting to really believe that's what I am because based off of the different perfumes that I have thus far, and I'm, I'm still trying to build my perfume up but based off the perfumes i have thus far seem like they're all floral scents so i think i'm more of a floral girl more than i am a musk or anything of that nature but anyways yep so that's all i'm about to get ready to be walking out the door i'm gonna check on the on the baby the puppy one last time before i leave he's already in his cage i think he sleeps so i'm gonna just check on him real quick now i'm gonna head out to the car and 
we may get something to eat. I might do like a solo um, date, a uh, solo lunch date with myself. I'm not 100% 100 sure because I may just grab me some food and come back home. So it just depends on how long it takes me to do everything else because I don't want to be gone too long from the house with the baby um, left here at the house. So um, anyways, I will see you guys when we get out and about. Peace. Hey, babes. It's another day. It's Thursday, January 12th. I am up for the day. Just got ready. About to go run some errands. I need to go get my nails done. Remember, this nail is sore. I'm going to get my toes repolished. I don't think I'm getting a pedicure. I don't need one. So, but we'll make that decision when I get there. Um, and I got to, I'm going to go back to the feed store to get a raw hide for the puppy so he can have something to chew on instead of chewing on us. So um, we have on these black oversized joggers that I got from Fashion Nova, a white long sleeve shirt from Old Navy. I have it tucked in the front, untucked in the back. This faux leather jacket that I got maybe from Marshalls. I have had it for a minute, so I don't remember. And then another pair of my little fashion glasses that I like to wear. I don't think I've worn these on camera for you guys yet. So this is my other pair. And then my same basic jewelry, Apple Watch, James Avery jewelry. My birthstone necklace from Zells. And did I say I had on my sequence of and my old faithful Kurt Geiger bag. So, yeah, this is the outfit of the day. We're about to get ready to leave the house. I'm going to go back here, go up here and get the dog situated, put him back in his cage. He's already used it. Um, I'm going to give him a treat, put him in his cage, and we're going to be out the door. So, I will pick back up with you guys, I think, when I get to the nail shop. Peace. Look at that, look pretty, I like it. Yes, I do too. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Beautiful. No, I don't look good. I don't now look the bad, but typical. No cut there, but Okay? Yeah. Uh oh, shoot. I didn't end the video so I wanted to come back on and let you guys know that I did go ahead and make it to the nail shop I got my nails and my toes done I actually got a pedicure everything came out great as you can see and yeah that's it but I just want to say thank you guys for subscribing to my channel I pray that you guys have a great and safe week and go ahead and don't forget to share my channel. Remember, guys, we are trying to grow, grow this channel. And I can't do it without you guys. So once again, I want to say thank you, thank you, thank you in advance for your support. Bye, and I'll see you guys next time.